gonna try something a little different today. Uh, I've never been a hunter. I don't really understand what it's all about. But in the state of Kentucky, there's over 350,000 people who hunt. And well, I've got some land here, so I figured I might as well give it a shot. I've got a camera, it's still early in the season. It's uh, September 23rd. So I've got a, about a month until deer season's really underway, at least for modern gun. So we're gonna walk back in the woods. And we're gonna try to find a good spot to hunt. We'll see what happens. Good way to get your steps in for the day. Well, I've encountered my first problem. This guy won't leave me alone. He is mine, but he likes going on walks too much, too. Okay. One of the things I've been thinking about is how do I get this deer out of here? You know, I've got 19 or so acres here. It's really hilly. I'll pan around and try to show you that now. I don't know how well it'll capture it on the video, but it's really hilly. It's a lot of brush. You know, I'm just going to let the forest grow. I don't really, I maintain the front, but not really the back part of the property here. So I don't want to get in too deep. I don't think I'll be able to carry this thing out of here. I'm a big boy, but we'll see. We actually just scared a couple off. I don't know if it was me tromping around running to get this camera or the dog. But there's several uh, right on that ridge over there. I just saw their tails and their, their legs as they ran off. I think I found my spot. It looks to be a trail that comes right through here. Um, it's a little bit flatter. I'll be able to sit up on this hill and kind of shoot down into this little bowl where I know I've seen them before, so they just ran off from. I'll have to figure out what to do with this dog. He's loud, but... Also, I don't want to uh, lead on anything. You know, I've been hunting before. I've been in the past. I have killed two deer. Three deer. Um, I just It was never really my thing. And I always went with other people. But now that I am a bit older and own my own land, I have plenty of guns, I figured I might as well try. With the prices of meat going up, we have plenty of freezer space. I have two young children, a wife that works really hard. I think it'd be good to supplement some of our beef with deer meat. Uh, it's abundant, it's healthy, it's lean, it's good for you. And if I can kill it, it'd be kind of fun. And I'm hoping to kind of tap into what this is all about. It seems spiritual for some people. It's getting back out into the wilderness. Um, getting your hands dirty and I guess harvesting an animal is what they call it. Harvesting a deer. I'm excited to try it. Really on my own this time. and See where I fail and see what I'm doing wrong. All I can do is try. I'll set up the video, set a picture, just because I like, kind of like watching them, seeing what's walking by. It's a pretty nice camera, and I got it pretty cheap last year at the end of the season. Maybe it was the beginning of the season, I don't really remember, but it worked well. Better if you have an angle, right? It's 
It's got a few different settings. Uh, I'm sure you can get as technical with it as you want. But uh, custom setting three. That's just video. Now let's hope that I've got this thing angled in some way that's appropriate, not too low. I'm actually going to raise it. It's a pretty wide lens. Yeah, so that's after I raised it up a little bit. Sorry if you missed some of that. Uh, you didn't miss much, but it's going to sit here. And we are going to be watching. It's kind of real faint. I did see a few tracks, and there's acorns all over this thing. So we'll be coming through here eventually. Um, down this way, there's kind of a flat bottom. This is kind of up on the hill. The camera's over here. The house is back that way. There's this little flat bottom down here. And I'm thinking if I stay up here somewhere, um, I'll have a pretty good shot down onto anything. No way I'm not shooting up, obviously. Who knows where that would go? Could it be shooting down enough? In my mind, that makes sense. I don't know. Um, yeah, I might sit here for a minute and see what we find. Do much with this guy. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time.